just got to our antique mall that we need to restock because we had some decent sales this past week and wanted to be stocked up for when people are off through uh, Thanksgiving. So I got Sidekick here, a little Miss My My. She's going to help a little bit. Uh, battery camera's low, but I think we should be okay. But we're getting here and restock, and I'll show you guys what I'm putting in there. And Maya's going to hold the camera for a minute. Hold it over here, babe. So it's a little wonky, she's got to get used to it. So stay tuned. We're here at our booth. We put out some of these that we got from the thrift store. And we put out these two things we got from the bins. And then we got a little bit of cart full. Another sign, another sign, another, and then some old Tupperware. We get everything in here, get it organized, and then move on with our day. Um, so we just got back from the Goodwill bins. Those babies. Excuse my hair. I'm getting a haircut maybe this weekend. I don't have my hat on. Um, so we just got a haul. It was like 91 bucks or something. Uh, just trying to stock up on a little bit because I'm going to be cross-posting everything to Facebook uh, because of their shipping and they're getting ready to do three days free shipping on items over 25. So I'm going to try to do a couple lots and just see how it works out. I don't know. But I'll show you guys what we got. Um, let's see, let me turn on this light. Excuse the house, we're cleaning and organizing and stuff. So we got a couple more of the canvas, the canvas boards for our projects. Um, because how much you pay for the canvases at the dollar or at um, Goodwill Bins, you can't go to the store and buy them for that. And we just have to paint over them to do what we want to do. So we got this, uh, that one. Then this one's kind of wood. And then we got this one. And then we got these two. We got these two little ones. I'd probably get those at the Dollar Tree, but they were there. Um, and then this is what we got haul-wise. So we got this lamp. It works. We got this Ninja Turtles umbrella, which is pretty cool. I got another one. Uh, it's Michelangelo. And then we got, I haven't even looked through this box, but this whole box was in there. Sewing needles, badges, these like sew-on stuff. They're just... A crap ton. Haven't even looked at it. Don't even know what's in it. Because uh, my daughter was with me. Um, of course, she wanted to go. And uh, her mission was to find trolls and Mr. Potato Heads. And she did a great job on Mr. Potato Heads. Um, but here's the rest. So we got a Simpsons Life and then a Nick Seen It. I got to make sure the pieces are here. And then we got this um, hanging or like a um, coat rack thing. Which I try to buy those because they're good for the booth. Um, and for random stuff around the house, but for that, for the price we paid, you can't beat it. Then I got this, this is like metal. It holds something. I don't know what it holds, but I thought it was cool. It hangs like this. I thought it was pretty sweet. And we got two decent big Nerf guns. I have the cage, I have the, the, um, um, chain for this one. And then this one, um, they both work fine. So I'm going to put some bullets in them and stuff and see make sure I thought that was pretty cool and if I find like cool weird, weird games like this I try to get them especially if they look complete if they don't they're only like a buck but um, I've had really good luck I open them up try to look and uh, so we'll see what that one's about um, got some more builder bear stuff Found one shoe couldn't find the other one got a builder bear backpack got these ice trays or, or chocolate molds for guns thought they were pretty pretty cool uh, that's like maybe a quarter um, and then I got this Olympus camera. I didn't look this one up because it was like in the package or it's in the thing. It looks like it works pretty good. So I don't know what it'll sell for, but for what, for what I pay for it, even if it's seven or eight bucks on eBay, I mean, you're not paying anywhere near that. So, um, sometimes you just got to take a gamble and, you know, it works. So that's good. Got some Tendo shades. Those are going to go into my man Tendo. Um, I got this, um, what are these? I forget what these are called. The, the Hex Bug with the remote. So we're going to see if that works. Um, got some JoJo Seawall headphones. Got this Hummingbird hanging feeder. Thought it was pretty awesome. I know somebody that's really going to like that. So that's probably going to be a gift. Um, <clears throat> if not, that would go in the booth for probably 15 bucks, 20 bucks. But. And then we got some window clings. All these were in one pile. 
for Christmas. So I'll probably I might throw these up. Might see if my daughter wants to use a couple of them, but throw them up on Facebook. Got another Barney plush. Uh, got a, a Yoshi plush. Got a newer um, Care Bears. He's from 05, I think. Has a clothes, so that's pretty cool. Found a tie dye Garfield, which I can clean him up. Then I found some of these cards, which are pretty cool. They're called Rideki. Never seen them, but some of them are pretty sweet. But those are going to go to my Mantendo. Um, anything I find like that, I have a, I have a box. Anything I find that's pretty light, like that ain't gonna really make a big difference. I put together. This is Tendo's box, so stuff's going in there for him. That stuff I've had laying around the house, or you know, it's really light stuff, or like books from the bins. You know, I watch his videos a lot, so I figured I'd help him out. Um, and then we got two bags of potatoes. And then one potato, and then a, a fully complete Buzz Lightyear potato. You're just chilling. Like, what? And then another one of these wood carts. It doesn't have the truck, but I found the truck. I have another one of these. It's a semi, a double-decker. And the truck was, uh, it's a Melissa and Doug. The truck, uh, I found like a week later that fit it. So I just got it for now. Um, got a couple of these cow tails, or a cow tails thing. And then I had, I had some cups. They might still be in the truck. I had some cups. They were uh, um, like Disney World that had these lids. And I had like four of them. They were in the basket. Um, so I might have missed I might have missed a bag in the truck. But anyway, and I got a couple of these uh, Sony power packs, which I, always get, which I always get them all. Got a remote. And then just a calculator, like a scientific calculator. And I got some movies. I'm trying to get full collection Star Wars got two games one's a PC game and then a PS2 Madden and then old ET Star Wars Turtle Tales stuff like that like like what's a DVD way at the bins like I have a scale I can figure it out at a dollar thirty nine um actually let's go let's go do that just for good content so it's what and if my math's wrong I apologize what not good math oh you want to say hi to puppy Say hi, Whisk. Say hi, Popo. Cool. Big way in. All right, so this is my workstation. Kind of crazy. I packaged some stuff earlier, but so let's see. We got so this DVD, and this should go for pretty much all DVDs. It weighs 3.2 ounces, and correct me if I'm wrong, but was it 16 ounces? Hold on, bro. 16 ounces to a pound. Uh, so that cost me, if I'm if if I'm right, it cost me 20 26 cents. The D DVDs and video games at the bins cost you about 26 cents if you're doing it strictly by weight. <clears throat> so, um, you know, I try to get any movies that. Um, that are good titles like Star Wars, all that stuff. Because if I get them all, I can package them all together for like twenty bucks in my booth, and I'll have a dollar in five DVDs. So it, it's it's worth it. I like to hunt. I just got to come up with a system for the stuff that I'm trying to collect, like um, like these Dr. Seuss books. I got a bunch of them. Goosebumps. Uh, I got a Scooby Doo Seek and Find. Got this old Rolls Royce hat. This old Gap backpack. These two shells probably go in Maya's room. This Barbie uh, holder that holds like a Barbie doll. Old Buck Bunny movie. And then some brain teaser video game. But I want to show you, I have a shelf temporarily. But it's like land. So I have these Land Before Time. I'm trying to collect all those. Then Lord of the Rings VHS. Uh, Rugrats. I got Barney. Here's some more of the, the Disney Walt Disney books. And then here's some of the games that I've verified. Walking Dead, Ninja Turtles, uh, Mortal Kombat. These are learning things from Maya School, X-Men. And then some more learning books. Got a bunch of those. And then these are just randoms that I've had. I got a bunch more. Just haven't gone through them. And also today I got this, this uh, fat Pikachu. <laughs> and then this gigantic Taz. It's pretty cool. His eyes are like vinyl. It's pretty sweet. So, um, 
I think I'm missing a box because I don't see the other um, cups I got. I'm going to go out to the truck and see. But um, last time I went to the bins, I don't think I recorded it because my camera was dead. But um, I dug out all these from the bins. They're all Hanes repair manuals. So I don't know what those go for. I just see guys grabbing them. But I grabbed them all. And then, of course, I grabbed bins while I'm there. Uh, and then Maya drew this. Hold on. Maya drew this on her boogie board. It's pretty cool. Good job. High five. Actually, at first, you guys, I didn't know how to draw a moon. You didn't know how to draw a moon until you just did your homework and you did a moon, so you now you know how to draw a moon? Yeah? Okay, say bye. Bye! Alright, so we had to go all the way back to the Goodwill bins, which isn't that far, about 15 minutes, uh, because I forgot a bag. I was like, where? I'm missing some stuff. Well, when we were bagging everything up, yeah, I just must have not put it in the cart, and I didn't realize it until I got out. So luckily, they kind of know me remember, and I called up there and said, yeah, we got the bag, so I went up there and got it. So um, luckily, because the stuff that was in that bag is probably going to pay for the entire haul. So here's what we got. So we got just a brand new set of tapes. We got this really cool winter plate, which is going to be good for the booth. We got this barn uh, barnyard welcome sign. We got this barometer thermometer set. We got this smart gear uh, tablet thing and those are the cups I was talking about Then we got a knuckles we got a uh, Bratz doll missing a foot which that's gonna go to uh, Tindo and Hannah because she collects Bratz dolls and then we just got this little house which goes with my um, which goes with this collection of like Americana type stuff which is gonna go in the booth eventually just I've just been collecting it just to get a good amount of it uh, we got this uh, orange lightsaber. Um, we got this Discover Kids uh, water bottle blower upper. And it has a thing where you could fill it up with water. We got it for us for next year for summer. And then we got these two video cameras. It is summer. This one is kind of... Um, the comps are kind of weird on this one. Because there's comps all the way up to $300 on this. But there's comps all the way as low as like 20 So I got to do some more research. And then this was a quick grab when I was just walking out. I saw it in a bin and I just grabbed it. Didn't look at it, nothing, just because it don't weigh a lot. But then if you can see right there, the screen's cracked. But, you know, if it's decent, I might use it for personal use or something. I don't know. We're, we're see. We're see how it works. I don't know. But worst case is I might be able to, I don't know, part it out or something. I don't know. But that's what we got. That's the whole haul. Um... Uh, yeah, I showed you potato heads, showed you everything. So we think that the one, uh, the one camera should bring at least a third, say it brings 40 bucks. Um, and we have $90 in everything. So if you take everything and divide it by 90, I mean, we like, like always we have between a dollar to $2 in, in each item. Um, <clears throat> because we probably, we probably have at least 40, 40 items. So. Some of them are personal use, some of them go in the collection just to complete a collection so I can sell it. But um, but other than that, like I said, that one camera should bring good money. Um, the plate and the barnyard and the barometer, uh, thermometer thing, and then a couple other things over, over here should bring decent money in the booth and or on eBay. Um, so we'll just see. We're just trying to stock up in case of a lockdown. Um, don't want to go broke doing it, of course, because that won't be any good. But, um, you know, spend three or four hundred extra dollars on, you know, the Goodwill bins and stuff like that. Just get a bunch of items because a lot of this stuff I'm going to cross post to Facebook um, once I post it. If I don't post it on eBay, then I'll post it for shipping. I just started posting for shipping on Facebook last week. I posted like two items just to make sure everything looked good um, and everything was good on Facebook's end. So if I post a lot more stuff and and we'll go from there so and i'm still thinking about opening up a second antique booth um but not completely sure there's another one down in springfield it's about 35 minutes away i might go check it out um but who knows we'll see we'll do one of the two and hopefully if we don't get locked down maybe we'll do both so we'll see stay tuned and be sure to subscribe and like this video um we're going to try to be more consistent and post 
um, at the end of a at the end of a haul. Um, if we go source anything, we're gonna try to do a video and then get it up and post it that night um, and just try to get more content out for you guys. Uh, anything you like, you want to change, see me change, do different, please let me know. I'm here to learn. So um, make sure you like and subscribe, and we will catch you the next time.